What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another video. Now in today's video as promised we'll be covering TOEFL independent writing. That's the essay topic that we'll be looking at together and I had a really fun time typing this sample essay so I can't wait to share it with you guys. However, before we go to my laptop to read the sample essay together, I want you guys to spend about two to three minutes brainstorming this topic on your own so that you can give yourself a chance to figure it out. All right, so let's go. All right, all right. So today's essay topic is, it is more important for students to understand ideas and concepts than it is for them to learn facts. Do you agree or disagree? Now for this essay topic, I'm going to agree. So my opinion is that understanding ideas and concepts is far more significant than simply learning or memorizing facts, information. Okay, let's look at the sample essay together, starting from the introduction paragraph. As everything in life is like a coin that has two different sides, people must weigh the pros and cons before jumping to conclusions. Education has undoubtedly evolved into one of the most important aspects of life in the 21st century. So students have had to cope with fierce competition and the unrealistic requirements that ensued from such competition. Therefore, children, teens, and young adults these days are asked to study mountains of information on a regular basis since schools have been pushing the envelope in an effort to distinguish between the adept and the inept ever since the advent of the grading system. A large number of individuals strongly believe that learning facts and memorizing information are the most effective means for students to accumulate knowledge and succeed in school. However, in my humble opinion, understanding ideas and concepts is the best way for students to genuinely become knowledgeable for the following reasons. So that's the introduction paragraph. There are, um, there are some sentences in between the hook line and the um, opposing thesis that are not necessary, but I just decided to add them in there for good measure and extra spice. Okay, first body paragraph. First and foremost, the majority of individuals would agree with the notion that Fully comprehending class materials will engender a myriad of advantages for students of all shapes and sizes. The main reason behind this rationale is that, no matter how foreign or difficult new concepts may be, students will have a higher chance of digesting the information if they figure out or are taught the ins and outs of the novel ideas. In addition to this, when people acquire complete comprehension of one concept, they will be able to branch out and absorb all other related concepts much more naturally making them become more versatile and like a sponge. To illustrate more thoroughly, let's take a closer look at math as an academic subject. Students in primary school start from basic arithmetic, such as addition and subtraction, and quickly move on to multiplication and division. Once the easy stuff is understood by students, they move on to more complex concepts like fractions, ratios, and geometry that begin forcing students to digest ideas that can be perplexing under improper guidance. In middle school, many students unfortunately start growing distant from math since their teachers simply expect them to learn new facts without any extra assistance. Hence, those who were not able to naturally learn or memorize novel ideas get left in the dust, whereas those who innately picked up the names of new shapes excelled. This becomes even worse as students move up the academic ladder and begin taking part in more advanced classes like calculus. On the other side of the coin, if students are given enough time and proper guidance to truly understand new ideas, they will become more independent in the course of time and essentially become self-learners rather than just baby birds with wide open mouths. All in all, we can't and shouldn't overlook the upsides of fully comprehending ideas and concepts taught in school. Okay, so that's the first body paragraph and it's primarily focusing on, it's only focusing on the upsides of fully understanding new concepts and ideas, okay? And the example that I decided to use was the, um, the, 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 chain of, the chain of math classes that students have to take, starting from basic addition subtraction to calculus, but they're all connected to some degree, so fully understanding each and every step will help students understand the next step better. That's what I was um, hammering home in this body paragraph. Now, let's look at the second body, which is gonna be focusing on the downsides of just learning facts, okay? On top of this, simply learning facts can result in unfavorable ramifications for participants in education. In the eyes of many people in present day society, merely studying or memorizing information is a primitive way of acquiring knowledge that is inferior to all other forms of information acquisition. Moreover, cramming and burning the midnight oil can be effective and lead to good test performances, but 
It would be an exaggeration to claim that those two study methods are ideal or the best ones. A great example of this would be my younger brother Milo. Milo is currently in the seventh grade and had a hard time in school due to his classes, but what he went through was entirely his fault. Milo never had to spend a single day studying as an elementary school student because everything he learned came naturally to him. The classes were so easy that he understood what the teacher introduced without much effort. Nevertheless, once the subjects became more complex and intricate, Milo's natural comprehension of the materials disappeared and he started to see his grades fall. Hence, he decided to learn as much as possible by staying up all night right before tests, but the results were sporadic and unreliable. Being his older brother, I decided to step in and offer a solution for his poor grades in history. Um, as a history buff, I was actually looking forward to teaching my younger brother social studies since it's what I'm truly interested in. Therefore, we spent many afternoons going over his textbook and notes from class when something really interesting started transpiring right before our eyes. Milo's grades in history started to skyrocket since he and I had such a fun time reading through his class materials, so he actually started connecting the dots and remembering much more information than he could before. He also told me that understanding why something happened really helped him figure out why another event might have occurred, thereby making it possible for him to even get the correct answers on questions he did not prepare for. Long story short, it's clear as day to me that only learning or memorizing facts can end up being detrimental and lead students down a long and inefficient road filled with stress. Okay, now, the second body paragraph was focusing on how simply learning and studying information, memorizing information, will not lead to long-term retention of the information that you try to absorb. Um, and the example that I decided to use in this body paragraph was of my fake younger brother who doesn't exist because I'm an only child. So guys, that's how I decided to tackle this essay. The first body paragraph is focusing on why I made my choice. And the second body paragraph, the downside of simply learning facts is that it, it won't lead to long-term or permanent results. Alrighty? Okay, I want you guys to read the conclusion paragraph at your own convenience. Let's move on to the outro. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, that just about wraps up today's video. If you guys enjoyed the sample essay, leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you still have not done so. Share the content with your close friends and family members if they need the extra assistance. But most importantly, if you are a self-disciplined and dedicated person, reach out to me about my tutoring services. Let's get the score that you need and deserve as quickly as possible. Peace.